Transition's been pretty good so far. Uh, it's nice that we have the men and women together. It's looking like a unit. We're unified for the first time in a very long time, probably back since I was on the program, back in the early 2000s. We've come a long way. We've grown a lot, but the kids have grown a lot, and they've really enjoyed each other's company so far this year. Some of the expectations we have for the women going into Mass Tech this weekend are to go out there and really just put it all out there. They've worked so hard for four months to get to this point, so now it's their time to shine. We expect Courtney to go out there and hunt down some girls in the 800 with Kira right behind her. We got Elizabeth in the mile hunting down a qualifier for D3. A Bernice Mensa and Abby will be one to watch in the dash this weekend as well as our relays. On the men's side we have some great uh, team expectations. Uh, we're looking to perform better than we did last year. We were third in the meet. I think with the talent we have and the improvements uh, as a team, we can definitely score higher than third. I would like to come away with the W, but that will come down to the uh, individual performances on the men. We have some great athletes competing. I expect a lot of PRs, but I think we're going to see some school records go down as well. We have the one seed in the pole ball, uh, the hammer, the shot put. Uh, we have the one seed in the 60. So all in all, we're looking pretty strong going into this weekend. Now that it's championship season, everyone should be hitting their pinnacle phase. Everyone should be at their highest. So going into the meet, they should be PRing, they should have a big throw, and that's ultimately what we want. We want everyone to succeed, and we want everyone to do their best, and I think we can do it. One of the biggest things we can do as a team is really make sure we're supporting each other, because um, a little cheering and a little support throughout the meet can go a really long way. Um, also, our girls just have to go out there and just compete like they've never competed before, and hopefully they can move up in the seeds and possibly get out an individual win, which could help us in the all-around title. The team's ready to go. Uh, we've worked hard for the last four months. Um, these kids are anxious to get out there, uh, and they're going to show you some things that uh, you haven't seen before. I think we're going to set some school records and come home with a couple of trophies. The girls are ready to go. All the hard work's been put in. They're ready to show up and show you what they've been working for. Let's go!